In this introduction to Turk's Head Knots video series, we're going to be tying a gaucho knot or gaucho knots from a casa knot. And what we're going to tie is a 19 part, 11 bite, 3 pass gaucho knot. We're going to tie it from a 7 part, 4 bite casa knot. And the formulas we we'll use are parts. Divided by bytes equal N plus R. So that's 19 parts divided by 11 bytes. We'll go in one time with a remainder of 8. Our next formula is bytes minus R equals our count value, V. So it's 11 bytes minus our R is 8 equals 3. The next thing we do is mark off the number of bytes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 10, 11. We place a zero over the top left mark. Now we're gonna count over three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, Two, three, 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 one, two, three. Now we mark our over and under coating for a three pass gaucho knot. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. And one more doing the traveling would be 19. So that's one less than the number of parts. Now we write down our numbers. Our zero is our left byte boundary, so we don't use it. So it's 4, 8, 1, 5, 9, 2, 6, 10, 3, 7. Now we repeat. 0, 4, Eight, one, five, nine, two, six. Now for the bottom, zero would be our right bite boundary. We start with the four. Four, eight, one, five, nine, two, six, ten, three, seven now we repeat zero four eight one five nine two six and for convenience i like to put my overs and unders above so that's under 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 over 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 under 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 over, 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 under, 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 over, over, over. Going this way, under, 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 over, 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 under, 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 over, 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 under, 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 over, over, over. Okay, now, since this is a big knot and my writing's kind of messy, I have typed out our run list so that we can see it as we mark these. And I'll tie my knot.
get my string untangled. Okay, we're looking. Our first one was a free run. Now we're looking for zero. It's an over. Looking for zero. It's an over. Looking for ones. So we have under, under, over, under, under, over, and under our standing end. Better spread that out a little bit or that'll get tight. Okay, looking for once. So we got under, over, under. Under, over, under. Okay. Now we're looking for our twos. So we've got under, over two, under, over. Under, over two, under. And over our standing end. Okay, looking for two up here. Under, over two, under, over. So, we go under this bite right there. Under, over two, under, over. Now, we're looking for three. We only got one of them. Okay. It is under, over, under, over, under, over. See our tracks right there? Under, over, under, over, under, over. Splitting our tracks. And that tied, as we come back to our standing end, that tied our seven part. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four byte casa knot. And we're on that line right there. So now we're still looking for three with under, over, under, over, under, over. Under, over, under, over, under, over. Okay. Now we're looking for four. There's one there and one there. So we got under two, over, under, over two, under, over. Okay. Under two. I'll move my pan. Over, under. Over two, see that? And then under, over. Okay. 
and I'm trying to pull clear through my knot, which I know is not a good thing. But I'm anxious to finish tying this knot. Okay, so we're looking for four up here. That's an over. It was an ugly over, but it was an over. Okay. So we got under two, over, under, over two, under, over. Okay, we're going right up through here with an under two, over, under, over two, under, over. Stay on this side. Okay. Now we're looking for fives. There's one. And there's one. So we've got under two, over two, under one, over two, under two, over. Okay. Under two, split that pair. Over two. Under, over two, under two, and over. Okay, see how we went under two? And we split a pair, and then we went over two, and we went under one, and then we were jumping pairs. Okay, we're looking for five. One right there. One right there. So it's under two, over two, under, over two, under two, over. Under two, over two, under, over two, under two, and over. Now we're looking for six. Under two, over two, under two, over two, under two, over two, all the way. Under two, over two, under two, over two, under two, and out over two. And that is our standing in because our six was this last one right there. Okay. Now we're looking for six. Under two, over two, under two, over two, under two, over two. Under two, over two, under two. Over two, under two. Oh, wait a minute. I only went under one. Back up. I was being greedy. Trying to go over pairs. But on this side, we split pairs. Under two, split a pair. Over two, split a pair. Under two. Now, in the second half of the knot, we do our over twos and under twos of our pair. See, like you're doubling. 
over two, under two, over two. Okay, we're looking for seven. One right there. So this is where we're gonna start our threes. Under two, over two, under two, over three, under two, over two. Under two, split a pair. Over two, split a pair. Over two, under two. Get my kink out. Okay, we've done an under two, over two, under two, and now we go over three. One, two, three, under two, over two. Okay, We're looking for seven. Under two. Split that pair over two, split a pair under two, split a pair. Now we do our over three, under two, over two. Over one, two, three, under two, over two. Now we're looking for eight. There's one there, one there. So we're going under three, over two, under two, over three, under three, over two. Under three, split that pair, over two and split a pair, under two and split a pair, Over three, under three, and out over two. Okay, we're looking for eight up here. There's one, there's one. So it's under three, split that pair, over two, split that pair. Under two, split that pair. And then over three. One, two, three. Split that pair. Under three. And out over two. Now we're looking for nine. So we have one there and one there. Okay, we got under three, over three, under two. Okay, under three, split a pair. Over three, split a pair. Under two, split a pair. Now we've got an over three, split a pair, under three, split a pair, and out over three. So one, two, three, split the pair. One, two, three, split the pair and out over one, two, three. So we're just really looking for pairs to split. Now we're looking for nine up here. So under three, over three, under two. Under three, split a pair. Over three, split a pair. Under two, split a pair. Over three, split a pair. Under three, split a pair. And over three, splitting a pair. 
Now, we are looking for the tan. And we don't, oh, right there. That gives us our under three, over three, under three, over three, under three, over three. Under three, split a pair. Over three, split a pair. Under three, split a pair. Let me pull this so it doesn't get kinked. Over three, split a pair. Under three, split a pair. And out over three. And that brings us back to our standing end. This is a regular knot. So we just go under three right alongside of our standing part. And that finished our 19 part, 11 bite, three pass gaucho tied from a seven part, four bite casa knot. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I hope that you will try tying this knot. It was a lot of fun. Thank you for watching the video.